So guys, we're here with Al Young from Jackson State, man, down here at the HBCU Legacy Bowl, man. Game just wrapped up. How do you feel about your week? How'd you feel about the game, man? Yeah, I, I felt great about my week. I mean, I came in, showed the scouts what I can do. I mean, they were talking, they wanted to see it in action, so they got to see it. And then just the game, just being able to play against some great competition out here, like, it was, it was amazing. And you got to play with some defensive teammates, man. Antoine, Keontae still on the team for you. What did it mean to suit up with them one last time? Well, it meant a lot. I remember just, like, I was just telling them in the last interview, like, we was on the bench. I'm like, y'all going in on this half? Yeah, yeah, we going in together. So, like, it's just knowing they know what I can do and I know what they can do. And I, like I was telling some of my DBs, I'm like, hey, if, if Antoine in, we ain't got to cover long. He'll get back there. If Keontae in, hey, he going to get to the quarterback or he'll get to the running back, anything. So, it was, it was the main thing, like, just brotherhood. I love it, man. Last year, man, SWAC champion, you know, Coach, Coach Prime did his thing. You guys did y'all's thing. I know it came up one game short, man, but how special was it to win the SWAC and go out as champions? Man, it was so special. I mean, just to come in and what Coach Prime did to change that whole program and it's just the culture around HBCU, like, it was just something special. And I felt like, I felt great to be a part of it. And I and, thank him for that. And, and speaking of that, man, what makes Jackson State culture under Coach Prime different from other programs? Uh, I just make it different because – First off, it's Coach Prime, and then second off, it's just he show you that it don't matter where you at. If you can ball, you can ball, and they go come find you. And Coach Prime's showing that. So. Absolutely. And lastly, man, congratulations on a great week. But what's your message to all the Jackson State fans out there? <laughs> My message to the Jackson State fans, I mean, we came up short again. But, hey, we go next year, y'all going to win it. Man, congratulations. Thank you.